Welcome back to the channel. Today we're trying out Oculus Medium. It's 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 a sculpting arty thing, but we'll go through the first tutorial. My kids have already tried this, but we'll have to go for the tutorial. Hi, to see and how welcome to Medium. What's up? This is a basic tutorial to get you started. After each lesson, you'll see some buttons come up. This lesson's about to end, so you'll see them in a moment. If you want to watch this lesson again, Ooh. click replay. Yeah, see. If you're ready to move to the next lesson, click next. Next. To end the tutorials and get started on your own, click done. Okay. Boop. Now I'm assuming he recorded that. Controller with this. basics. Okay. Before you start sculpting, let's yep. get you acquainted with your tools. Hold both controllers straight out in front of you. Done it. The black controller is your support hand. This is support. The support hand is where you'll access all the options and tools within Medium. It's like your toolbox. The white controller in your dominant hand is your tool hand. You'll use your tool hand to interact with your sculpt, the menus, and the sculpting tools themselves within Medium. I can't deal with it. I don't... Done. I can't deal with it. Right. Anyway, I know the buttons. I'll just, uh, I'll just try and go for it. Right. So, um, we've got all the tools here. If you push up on the stick, you get all your tools, clay, paint, smooth, inflate. We'll go through each of those, see how they go. On this hand, we have color on the B button. Choose a color or grab a drop if you want to match it to something you've already done. What else have we got? Let's do that color. Uh, we got our settings button, which is A. Where you can choose the different clay or depending on what tool you got choose different things sizes all that add erase trigger taper most of this stuff is really good stamps is awesome because you can just grab something and boom there it is that's quite cool so uh we've on the um support hand as he calls it uh so it's up as you can see on the top i gotta change this that's irritating now so you can see on the let's shrink that on the top here, we got tools. Left is undo, right is redo, down is layers, where you can layer things up so you don't screw up other parts then, which I find is nice. This one is a bit unusual. I haven't quite worked out what this one is for, but I'm assuming it's maybe setting up the scene because you've got a light. This is Y on the left control. Uh, grips moves everything around or well, I've selected this light so if I hold grip I can move it around I think I can no I can just point it in certain directions so that lights up this there you go see so that's cool right now let's put that back up there I'm gonna go back to home new confirm so it's triggers for most things I have no idea what that is oh I didn't know I could change that as well okay that must be for, paint, for painting. This stick, the right stick, makes your object bigger or smaller. So we're going to attempt to make something. Now I'm not the most artistic, but hopefully we can learn some things as we go along and I'll show each of the weird things. So I want to start with a nice, a nice green. So we'll go with a nice light green. There we go. So you just move your hand off it and there it is. So we're going to go with maybe there, 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 that looks nice. This is giving me my grassy hills. Also, if you hold both grips, you can make things way bigger. So we're gonna work on our little project here, like this. So what I want is maybe a brown. Have we got a brown? There we go, we have got a brown. I wanna make this a bit smaller. A bit smaller, up there. There we go. And maybe one here as well. There yeah, lovely. Yeah, nice green again. And we're gonna tag that off right. Now, how would I make this flat? Is there a way I can make this flat? Hmm, there's a flatten tool, but I don't think that's useful. Right, the smooth tool is great for spraying on things. Whoops, I messed that up completely. Let's not use the smooth tool right now. Okay, we'll stick with clay and keep building up layers. Can I make this flat? That's what I want to know. Sends. I don't think I can make it flat. But we're going to try and build up this tree now. 
It's going to be a palm tree. Because <laughs> that's easier. There we go. And this one, palm tree. Yes, I know this looks like a 10 year old's job. Or even worse, maybe. Let's fill that in a bit. There we go. Right. So, what we're going to do is we're going to zoom into this. We're going to smooth. What the flip happened there? Smooth. Oh, that is big. That's why. Let's going to smooth out this area. Why is my smooth tool really powerful? Okay, that is not working for me. We'll just smooth out this area. I guess it's for if you have more than one layer, maybe. Let's try, let's try building this up. There we go. Okay, so we'll shrink all this down. What? I'm going to grab the clay and I'm going to make it into a square or a cube. A cube, not a square. We're talking 3D. Make this nice and big. I want it to be brown. I'm going to stick this here. Oh, there we go. That's all right, actually. Back's hanging over a bit. We may have to change that. So we'll grab our thing, get the exact same green, change to circle. We can just build this up then, can we? Like that. There we go. I love the noise it makes, it's so satisfying. Yep. Smooth this out a bit. There we go. Lovely. May need to smooth that actually. That's not working. <laughs> there. That's nice. Okay, so I haven't actually tried all of these tools yet, so this should be interesting to see what happens. Uh, I need. What do I need? I need a sort of house shape, don't I? How the hell am I going to do this? Uh, maybe if we get a square, I mean the wrong tool, clay. Let's get a square, oh, that's colour. But we want a sort of black, black roof, brown? With a sort of red colour. Okay, and I want to change this to a square. So we're going to do it a bit bigger. Like that. Because what we're going to try is use the cut tool. We're going to just cut it. There we go. That's going to work that out. And then it should have made an extra layer, which it didn't. Whoops. Why didn't it make an. Okay, we're going to use a different tool. We're going to use the flatten. Make it nice and big. We're going to do this. There we go. Uh, oh, oh, that's pretty bad. That's kind of weird. There we go. Oh! That'll do, yeah! We can work with that. What other tools do we have? We have um, inflate, which I'm not sure what happens. Whoa! Okay, that's what happens. That just inflate stuff then. Whoa! That tree is weird now. What else have we got? <laughs> Smooth cut, flat, and swirl is just weird as hell. Watch this. Shabadoo! That did not work. Shabadoo! See? And a bit of weirdness. So we are going to carry on. Clay. I wonder if there's a way we can change this slightly. I want it more. Ah, erase. Here we go. That could be useful. I want a sort of door shape. So we're going to zoom in a bit and make that a lot smaller. How big's this house going to be? Where's it gone? Oh god, I'm in the floor! Oh, it won't let me go. It won't let me bring the floor down anymore. Thank you. So maybe, what, like cut there? Straight up.
Right, we need to paint this floor pink. What colour floor should we have? Yellow? Hmm. Bright yellow! That's a there we go. Perfect. It's looking fab. These are some massive birds. <laughs> there we go, that looks great. So also to save, you can take a, you can either uh, save it, there's a quick save, save as, you can load things from before. You can also do this weird recording thing. We'll do photo quickly. So photo comes in the left hand and voila, that's a photo done. Also, look at this, we could just zoom right in. That's not coming anywhere close to me, is it? And Kablowy! Maybe, maybe an epic shot like this. There we go. Kablooey! Perfect! Also with the record, let's try the record so I can uh, show you a bit on that. Uh, begin, should we go begin? So here we go, this is the house. We're going to see if we can, I don't know, uh, put some more birdies in the sky. So we'll make them a bit smaller. One, two. These are massive birds, I tell you. One, two. And there we go. And then what you do is you click home and stop. And that should have saved it as a recording. Let's see if that works. Play. So here we go. This is the house. We're going to see if we can, I don't know, it's uh, me. some more buddies in the sky. So we'll make them a bit smaller. One, two. These are massive birds, I tell you. One. I'm guessing it uses the Oculus uh, microphone. And then what you do is you... See? That's so cool. That must be how they recorded the uh, tutorial. So we'll leave it with that one. I'll show you something. Oh, God, why did I do that? Close. We'll save this quickly. Enter. Right. And I will load up the other things that I've created already which was this. This was the first thing I made. It's a snowman! Quite easy, just three big white circles. Obviously. So we'll do it, we'll give him a little, give him a little, uh, uh, a friend. There we go. Some black. Oh, why did I do that? No. You need orange for the nose because it's a carrot nose. There. Now, the nose I found something using the stamps, but there are loads of stamps. Just look at this range. If I do this, I can just go down and make stuff like a head. Oof, look at that thing! Creepy! So, there's loads to do in here. What else did I uh, make before? Go back. Ah, this is my attempt at uh, ignore. This is my attempt before. Yes, I'm in a scene! Look at him! I have no idea what he is, by the way. Wait, look, we just. Hello! So, let me just have a quick show of you. So, it's great because you can either make him as a model, or you can just be in a massive scene, just lay it down on the floor. But yeah, there you go, you got a pet! So, thank you for watching this episode. This was Medium, uh, Oculus Medium. Make sure to like the video if you like it, subscribe if you want to see more. Good boy. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.